Hello everybody. So very exciting subject today about hygiene in the office. Um, most of you either have cleaners or the company you um, have space from on a flexi basis provides cleaners. Um, really um, probably the time now to start thinking about the level of cleaning that they offer. Um, it may result in you spending a little bit more money but obviously you want to be really, really careful and cautious that you're hitting and reaching the standards that we all will need moving forward. Um, sounds really quite annoying to talk about it, but um, I think this is actually an employee um, sort of issue that will arise. You will be questioned of it, on it by your employees and it's probably best for you to approach your employees explaining what you will be doing and how you're doing it and actually put together some small brief document or presentation that you can share with them to explain not only what your responsibilities are as an employer, but also what their responsibilities are as an employee, keeping up to those standards. Um, there are a lot of companies now that we're seeing um, on the flexi side who are going to probably be using the cleaning side as an emphasis to encourage businesses to move in. So you're going to see a lot of marketing sitting around that aspect. Um, but I think um, the nervousness of, nervousness of some people returning to work, um, obviously, we haven't been talked about traveling to work, you know, trains, undergrounds. And, you know, they're talking, I think even this week they've been talking about they think there's going to be um, a huge amount of people all trying to travel, obviously, at the same time, which um, from a personal perspective doesn't really sit very well with me. But um, then when you get to work, I think people are really going to want to feel safe and secure um, and cleaning is a big part of that. Providing face masks, obviously, and, you know, hand sanitizers, I think is probably a given in some senses. But I definitely think the process that you're going to do and you're going to agree to internally um, will keep a lot of people hopefully happy. Um, and happy workforce, obviously, is going to be beneficial for everyone. Um, I know it's not directly linked to commercial real estate, but I just thought I'd mention it because it's something that we're working on and something that a lot of our clients have actually asked us about. Um, and we've sort of put it forward to them that they start speaking to these companies, the cleaning companies right away um, and look at what they can do. Um, hope everyone is well and uh, see you all soon.